Hello, it's maths time now and Tricky's out of the shed and he's going to help apparently. I don't know, I don't know, I don't know what he's going to do but he said he wants to come out of the shed and apologise for making a mess in our classroom and he's heard that you're coming back to school soon so he'd like to help with maths. Watch this. Okay, we've got Tricky back today. He's been moaning that he's bored without you. Can he help with math? So I said yes. He said he likes our song. 20, 19, 18 and 17. He said he really likes that. You do like it. Okay, you can join in with us, but you were quite bad last week. So if we let you join in, can you behave? Pinky promise. I think he's so lonely without you. I think he's decided he's going to behave yourself, aren't you? Okay, so he's going to be really good with us and he's going to help us with our song, aren't you? Maybe he's changed. Maybe he's going to be a good boy. He's quite cute, really, isn't he? So you're not going to ruin our song for going to join in. Okay, so you know the song. And you know the dance. And you don't need us to teach you. And you're the best. Yes, I'm the best. Okay, we'll sing. You dance. 20, 19, 18 and 17. 16, 15, 14, 13, 12 and 11. Not bad. My turn. Okay. Why do you want me to do it? Why do you want me to do it so much? I don't know why you want me to have a turn. You've seen me do it lots of times. Okay, 20, 19, eight. Oh, tricky. No more. Okay, why? No, you can't. Oh. That was disgusting. Are you going to do it again? Please don't. You were just being a bit silly. And you're sorry. Please do it one more time. Okay, yes, we'll do it one more time. Can you help me, boys and girls? Should we do it one more time? And you're going to just, can you just show me the numbers this time on my hands? Okay, he's just going to show us the numbers now, aren't you? Good boy. Okay, well, you wait there then. We need to try and teach him how to behave himself all the time. When he's good, he's really, really good. Okay, ready? 20, 19, that's better. 20, 19, 18 and 17, 16, 15, 14, 13, 12 and 11. Oh! Bed. Okay, so I hope you got on okay with your Numicon and your pegs or your counters or maybe you were lucky enough, enough to have Smarties. My mum's going to get me some more today because Louis ate them and got them all around his mouth. So maybe you used pasta, pom-poms. Today, I'm going to use the Numicom to show you something. But then afterwards, when you're doing your work, you're not going to use Numicon at all. It's all on your sheets of paper. And I'll show you that in a minute. Have a look at this. Okay, this number sentence says five, take away two equals... And next three number, which I'm not going to write on the table because I want us to still have our treat from the party part. How would I work that out? So five take away two. If I take bunny two and put him here to cover up two of five's holes, how many holes have I got left? One, two, three. Check that on our fingers. Five pieces of Numicon. Take away two. One, two. How many's left? One, two, three. It's the right answer. Okay, if I had nine, take away six equals, what would our answer be? So I take six, I carefully use six to squash number nine, making sure it's lined up. How many holes have I got left? One, two, three. Three is my answer. Three again, not another pattern. 
let's try another one. If I had seven, take away five, what would my answer be then? I'm going to take five and pop it on top very carefully. How many holes are left spare? How many holes has seven got left? One, two. If you said two, well done everybody. That's the right answer. Now when we look at this work, this is what you've got today. Two take away one equals, now we can't pick up this numicon and put it on top, can we? Because it's on the paper, we can't move it. So we're just going to count this numicon, one, and then use this number to cross off from the first piece of numicon. So we've got to cross off one circle, one hole. How many holes are left? One. Two take away one equals one. Let's try this one. So we've got a three piece here. Take away two. One, two. Let's take away two holes. One, two. How many has number three got left? Just one. One again. We keep getting these patterns. Let's try the next one. Number four. Take away one, two, three. That's a three piece of numicon, so we need to cross off three holes. One, two, three. How many are left? One. One again. Tricky, have you been touching this? Let's try the next one together. Five, take away one, which is one piece of numicon. So take away, if we hopped him over to there and he sat there, how many seats would be left on number five? One, two, three, four. It's not a one again, is it? I'm going to do this one with you and then you've actually got about four sheets of paper to do this by yourselves. Let's try this one. One two, is it two? So if he was to jump across, one, two, there'd be one, two, three, four left. Do you think you can do the other pages by yourselves? I don't know how you're going to get on with that one today. I've done a sheet with you, but it's very difficult if you can't move the numicon, you have to do it on paper. You've got three more sheets. Can you try and do them by yourselves? If you're stuck with them, rewind this video, play it again, and it might help a little bit. Why does he love that poo emoji so much? Anyway, you've got your sheets to do here. You've had quite a lot of sheets to do for phonics. You've now quite a lot of sheets to do for maths. You're not getting a break today, are you? We had two fairly easy days and then boom, straight back in. Okay, get on with your work. I'm going to choose a bunch of bananas as my sticker today. I'm going to put my bananas on Wednesday. Guess what? We've got these two days of home learning and then we've got next week. And then after that, you're allowed to come back to school. You can come back. We can play again. We can learn in the classroom again. Home can be home again. and You don't have to do lots and lots of work every day when you're at home. We're going to have our party on the first day day back. How do you feel about that? So you're coming, we'll have a day of playing, getting to see everybody and then after lunch we'll have some music and some games in our classroom. I cannot wait to have you back. What will you wear? <gasps> see you tomorrow!